Hey everyone, it's Ria. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be exploring a brand that is completely new for me. So I've never tried anything from Besame Cosmetics. So I saw on the trend mood, um, on the trend mood Instagram, this new collection. Uh, inspired from Marilyn Monroe so I got pretty excited first off because of course it's Marilyn Monroe and second of all because this brand has been kind of like popping into my brain here and there I know that it's like a more antique inspired so there is nothing that I love more than old things that's just like a thing of mine I love antiques I love Kind of like the old Hollywood world, all of that is just such a beautiful world that I absolutely love. So anyway, uh, before we get into the video, I would really appreciate it if you decide to subscribe. So be sure to hit the red button down here so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. So let's get right into this beautiful collection because again, this is honestly such a beautiful product that I am so happy I picked up and I am so happy to kind of like find more products from this brand. So first off, um, beautiful box. This is where uh, you received the package. I did get the smaller size of the collection. The collection came out with two different, I want to say boxes, like box sets. So this one is the red carpet the red carpet compact and lipstick set so this is the one that i got but they do have the bigger compact or the bigger set which is the essential marilyn collection this one that i got is going to include a lipstick and a powder for your, like a face powder and then this is going to retail for 105 dollars it is still available at the vesame collection the vesame uh, cosmetics website i'll leave all the links down below and then they also had the Essential Marilyn Collection, which that one retails for $2.45. It is still available. The bigger collection comes with uh, lipsticks. And let me tell you exactly what it comes with. So it comes with a mascara, three lipsticks, including the one that comes in this, in this little box. And then it also comes with two lip liners, eye pencils, two glosses, a highlight and an eyeshadow quad which honestly I really wanted to get this eyeshadow quad but it was not sold individually it's just sold in the big set I didn't go ahead and purchase this because it was a lot of money it's $245 I mean if money is not an option I would have definitely picked it up I mean this is the picture of the eyeshadow quad absolutely stunning and then there's a picture of the quad i knew like i know i would have loved this quad because that's the kind of shades that i like but i just couldn't bring myself around to spending almost 250 dollars that being said i did pick up this beautiful set which we're going to put to the test in a minute it comes again with the uh lipstick that i'm wearing which is a stunning red if you didn't know it red lipstick is my favorite and then it comes with a um translucent compact powder so when you open it up beautiful it comes with the inside it's gonna be gold with a picture of Marilyn and then her signature and then it basically just says you know a few little things regarding the collection itself you get again this compact is just to die for and the best thing I mean on top of it being beautiful to look at you can actually once you uh, finish your powder you can just uh, refill it with the powders I believe you can refill it with basically any of their powders that's absolutely stunning I love that idea because I would not want to get rid of my compact on top of it being beautiful it also has uh, this design is something very specific so this design is actually inspired I'm gonna read it right here it says, the octagonal compact with black floral design is inspired by a compact from Marilyn Monroe's personal collection. Refillable metal and plated with gold. Once you're done with the powder, this keepsake compact can hold any besame powder refill. The top features black enamel, enamel <laughs> over sculpted gold flowers with added Swarovski crystals. That I didn't know. So these are actually uh, real Swarovski. Swarovski, that's a hard word, crystals. 
that's pretty cool it's kind of like an extra bonus and this compact is very very heavy so it's very weighted so weighted products always on my eyes translate to a more luxe product so i really love that and then of course then we have the red lipstick which this one it's just called the red hot red and this is based on Marin's lipstick in the movie in some La in some like it hot so it's adorned with Marilyn's signature and fall diamond top on the very top of the lipstick and then it says the black and gold case highlights the star's signature glamour so in a, in like just the box in general and this is going to be a true fire engine hue red a deep brilliant color with a warm yellow toned base so it is going to be enriched enriched with plant based squalene and vitamin e wow i haven't read that much in a long time out loud <laughs> i do apologize for that horrible reading but anyway i just wanted to show you uh, real quick what the compact looks like and the lipstick in the case it is very very stunning so let's go ahead and stop bubbling and put this part up you do have a small mirror and then you get a little um the plastic protector is gonna be marilyn's face as well so super adorable and i got mine in the translucent shade so like as like i mentioned i already have powder i'm sorry uh product on my face i just need to powder so i'm gonna use my usual elf uh, powder brush and I'm going to start applying this on my regular areas. And I'm going to use my bigger mirror. And that mirror is going to be a good size for whenever you're on the go. But if I'm home, I would rather, much rather have a bigger mirror. So this is going to be a, uh, a translucent powder. So I think it's, it'll work with basically any skin tone. So I do like that. So with a little bit extra, I'm just going to powder my forehead just a tiny bit. Okay, so that went on really smooth. I really did like it. I mean, it is a powder, so I think it looks good. I'm going to go ahead and leave my cheeks without any product because I do like to apply all my other products and basically always leave that area, like this area, without powder because the most powder that I use is going to be a little bit on my forehead and then down my T-zone, but I do like to pack on a lot of powder around my eyes, which is where I do set, because uh, I want to set the concealer that I just placed. So anyway, this looks really good. I like it. I can't really tell you 100% until I'm done with my makeup and, you know, the day goes on, but I like it. I've actually been meaning to get a pressed powder because for the longest time I've used my hourglass that's you know, a loose powder, so I felt like I was needing a good pressed one. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my makeup, and then we'll come back to try on the lipsticks, the one that came in this beautiful packaging, and then I get it's all done. I wanted to go for something very classic, because the lipsticks that I'm about to try on are more on the reddish, intense side, which I am so happy, because my favorite lipstick is going to be a red one. So first off, we have, of course, the one from the collection, and it comes in the beautiful box and it's in the shade red hot red i love this component it's gonna be all gold and it has you know marion monroe her signature down here and the lipstick and then the very top of the component you get those kind of like semi crystal you know crystal looking detail you open it up and then you get the absolutely stunning red lipstick i really really love intense reds so this one will be just kind of like your classic red and it has the Besame uh, logo right here on the side of the component. I'm going to try this one as my second one because I do have another one that I also picked up. I was already on the website so I thought why not. So I did get the shade Carmine to really resemble for 1931. So that box is going to be this beautiful a uh, baby yellow color and then it has the branding and then the name of the lipstick is on the very top and then you open it up and you get the actual beautiful beautiful component this is also going to be gold just so you can see them here side by side the normal lipstick is just a tiny bit smaller just very very uh, small difference but you can see there right there here is the Marilyn Monroe and here is the regular one same gold coloring but the regular does have this beautiful detailing on it it has the branding on the side with the besame name and then it's going to be a more round component you open it up 
and then you also get the same as the Marilyn one so it has the Besame on it and then here is the shade also a beautiful detailing on the actual uh, bullet it does have the brand right there and here is the shade so again just for comparison I'm gonna put them side by side both with of course you know this one is even also a red undertone but this one is more like orangey and this one is the true red so I'm gonna go ahead and first try the Carmine lipstick just so I can remove it and then we'll go ahead and apply the Marilyn one and I did remove the plastic protector from the mirror so I could actually use it so it is still a pretty decent size for a mirror you know you're gonna use this for travel to take it in your purse and I mean how beautiful is this packaging I still can't get over how pretty this is so anyway there's just a little bit of chapstick on my lips right now so I'm gonna go ahead and apply Carmine first Okay, so here we have Carmine. It is a beautiful, beautiful shade. Uh, the only thing that I do notice is that it, of course, it's going to be a more uh, yellowy, orange undertone. So I feel like my teeth are not looking as white as I normally, you know, with other lipsticks. This is just the way, you know, the undertones of the lipstick, it doesn't pull as making my teeth look a little bit more yellow than they really are. So that's probably gonna be a downsize. I mean, it doesn't really bother me that much because my teeth are pretty white to begin with, but just I thought it would be important to mention, but here we've got uh, Carmine. The reason we're here is going to be to try on this lipstick from the Marilyn Monroe collection. This again is gonna be in the shade Red Hot Red. I already removed the other lipstick and I tried to use a little bit of the same concealer and foundation that was on the brush just to kind of like prevent my lips from having the other shade on them. So now let's go ahead and try this one. And here we have the absolutely gorgeous Red Hot Red lipstick from this collection. I really, really love it. It's also going to be a lipstick that has that yellow base tone to it. So no, it's not going to make your lips also like super white. But it doesn't bother me. Like I'm looking at the mirror right now. And although it doesn't look, make my teeth look extremely white like others, it's still... For being a yellow based lipstick, I still feel like my teeth look really, really good regardless of it not being the undertone that usually makes your teeth look whiter, if that makes sense. I really love it. I think this is definitely a collector's piece. Even if you don't like Mary Monroe or you're not like a fan, this is still a blue, a beautiful uh, red lipstick. So regardless of that, if you like red lipsticks, I highly recommend you pick this one up. So anyway, here we have a Red Hot Red. What a beautiful collection, you guys. I am really, really happy I picked this up. And this just made me so much more intrigued on this brand. I definitely want to try more of the lipsticks and more of the products they have to offer. I, as a very much lover of anything antique, I am so surprised that I've never tried anything from this brand. Because the whole aesthetic of this brand is like old school antique times so anyway this is definitely a must for me especially especially this beautiful uh component i absolutely love how you know the details how how heavy it is because it just gives it more kind of like a more luck a more luxe feeling because it is such a heavy material it's a beautiful design it's just perfect to just keep on your vanity to take with you the mirror is a pretty good size that you would be okay with just doing your makeup here and the product itself it's really good i was in need of a translucent powder and what better than a powder that you can refill and you have it in a beautiful component please let me know in the comments down below if you've tried anything from this brand and if there's anything that i need to pick up because honestly i am very very intrigued and i want to get more products from this brand I want to support this brand more on my channel and of course I am a die-hard lipstick lover and whenever the lipsticks come in a gold packaging I want them all in every single color so the lipsticks itself were very comfortable I feel like they're like that kind of like old-school matte lip that even though they're matte they're still gonna be very comfortable on the lip so you can still see that there's a little bit of give to them they're not gonna be 
full flat matte but they're not shiny if that makes sense so this definitely reminds me of a lipstick like my grandma would have or my mom would have like back in the day well you guys thank you so much for watching like always if you did enjoy this video please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you leave and i'll see you in the next one bye